what's good guys it is your boy jason jv yeah i probably sound a little weird because my mic's actually back there uh we're gonna check out uh the latest wwe 2k22 update let me uh move my camera over so you guys can see me better um and yeah real quick i just want to show you guys the the new shirt i got the updated jjv wolfpack style shirt um you might not be able to see the emblem that good it's actually that logo that emblem if you will that's right above my head yeah that's it's the same one on the shirt and then on the back it says only alphas and it's got the skull with the nautical star on the forehead you know what i'm saying so yeah this shirt if you want to get it it's available in my second storefront in my teespring merch shop uh the link should be in the video description down below if not you can always check my about me section um in the about me tab it should be linked there uh as well and it's going to be the second storefront you're going to want to click on to get this shirt also if you guys recall if you watch my uh mail my rise um you remember when my character was wearing the poppy chulo shirt well there you go this is the official jjv poppy chulo shirt that my uh mail my rise character which is your boy here one was wearing so as you can see yeah it has the poppy chulo you know saying in the old english print with the two roses and then the back just like again in the game with my creative character you got the jjv logo with the mexican flag uh pattern on it along with the hot rod pinstriping right underneath sorry i just want to make sure i'm i'm getting a good shot of it on cam so yeah if you want to get either shirt this shirt or the poppy chulo shirt it's available in the second storefront um at my teespring merch shop so yeah and don't forget uh discount code jv2 will take 10 percent off on all your purchases so yeah it would mean the world if you guys can go pick up one of these shirts if not both of these shirts i mean hey you know what i'm saying that would be greatly greatly appreciated that would really help out the channel you know what i'm saying to keep the boy going and uh yeah so anyway now um as i mentioned in the last video you guys may have recalled i did do a video on the bonsai pack dlc trailer um i did get it i did install it i do have season pass so it was just a matter of me having to install it again let me just adjust my camera so you guys can see me better <clears throat> so yeah i did uh install the bonsai pack and then we just got the new patch patch 1.10 or patch 110 however you want to call it and uh, we are about to put it to the test but yeah scoot up a bit because my tv is kind of like that way <laughs> and i'm trying to make sure i'm able to see it good so what we're going to do is we're going to um just play an exhibition match and um i want to do something to so we can show off um the bonsai pack i think what we'll do is we'll do a six-man tag so we can have like all the males in the bonsai pack because i believe it's yokozuna umaga yokozuna umaga rikishi and omas i believe is um uh is, is how you say the guy's name um again my bad for not getting the guy's name right um i haven't been watching tv i don't really watch tv anymore i just watch the highlights you know what i mean i watch um youtubers like Sala Monster, Don Tony, um, to get like my highlights and whatnot. I also watch Steven Larson when they do like show recaps and stuff like that. Um, so yeah, but anyway, what we'll do is for the bonsai pack, we'll have the, the four guys. So I think what we want to do is we want to do eight man and uh, we'll do a tag team and then we'll have them see here match options let's see i can pick an arena right yeah select arena i think we we'll use one of my custom arenas too um so yeah i got an original one called the jjv's mayhem asylum i'm not sure if i uploaded this to the community creations or not i'm gonna have to double check if not i will definitely upload this arena so if you want a jjv uh arena you're more than welcome to it uh, we'll use my nwo battleground uh custom arena and uh let's see indie circuit ref no we want a an official wwe ref i think we'll use my man angelo dawkins uh let's see let's 
special. I think we'll keep everything as is. Yeah. Um, so what we'll do is I don't think I'll play this match. I think I'll, I think we'll what we'll do is we'll watch it together, and let's see if here we go. Download superstars. So I don't think we want Omas to kick it off. I think what we'll do is we'll have Rikishi come up first. So let's confirm him. Let's get uh let's see. There we go. Let's get Yokozuna. So, Rikishi, Yokozuna, and then Umaga was another one. Here we go. Umaga, Confoim, and Omas. Uh, let's see. Ah, there he is. All right. Confirm. And then I think what we'll do is we'll have them take on NWO 22, which is my uh, updated NWO faction. So I think what we'll do is we I think we have enough members. So let's get, um, let's see, customs. So yeah, we got my custom Undertaker 91 to 97. I mean, that should be obvious given his render is so big. I got my, uh, not my, but, um, the downloaded uh, Triple H 98 from the My Faction. We got Super Cena. We got Sting. We got 97 Shawn Michaels. And then we got Santa Claus. I'm still working on him. I'm probably going to give him uh, either Umaga's moveset, Rikishi's moveset, or Yokozuna's moveset. I'm not sure yet. Uh, Rock 98, Rock 2000, Ray Smith, who is actually, or who was, um... What's that one dude's name? Um, shit. I forget the name of that one Mexican wrestler that they have on... Um, he, he was supposed to be... El Mago Jr. That's who he was supposed to be. El Mago Jr., but I customized him and made him his own character. Uh, so, yeah, we got NWO Miz, which I think we'll go ahead and we'll confirm him since he's the first one that I was able to uh, click on. And let's see, customs, customs. Where are my customs? Downloaded customs, there we go. Let's see, so we got Miz, let's see, who else, who else, who else, who else? I know I got more. Okay, yeah, we'll go ahead and confirm NWO Cena. We got NWO Dolph Ziggler. Okay, here we go. Now they're starting to line up. Confirm. And uh, let's get uh, Robert Root. I still need to make um, some an NWO attire for. But he is technically in the NWO 22. I mean, it makes sense because him and Ziggler were, uh, were a tag team. I don't know if they still are. Like I said, I don't really watch... I don't really have cable, so I don't really watch TV. I never really watch TV. I just watch, you know, I, I just check out highlights and whatnot. Um, so we'll go ahead and we'll confirm. So yeah, here we go. The four guys in the Bonsai Pack versus NWO 22. Let's go ahead and start this match and see who wins. It should be interesting. Actually, let me see if I can go ahead and take the logo down so we can get a better view. But yeah, there we go. Oh yeah. So yeah, this NWO Battleground Arena that I created, you can get it at Community Creations. Um, One of the tallest competitors in WWE history. The personification of intimidation. The Colossus has arrived. The following contest is an eight-man tag team match. Introducing first, from Lagos, Nigeria, weighing in at 400 pounds, Omas. So it is Omas. Okay, we got name confirmation. 
So I shouldn't be messing up on his name anymore. <laughs> I am thinking about doing a custom NWO Omos and maybe put him in NWO 22. Only question is, I don't know who I'm going to re... Um, well, I don't know if it's a question, but I mean, I, I don't know who I'm going to replace him with. Because I can only have up to five members in the NWO, so I don't know. I do have Cole Quinn as an NWO member. Maybe I'll replace him with Cole Quinn. Or replace Cole Quinn with him. Hey, but how about my NWO arena, though, man? Come on, now. Let's go. Look at that. NWO chairs. We got the NWO emblem right here. Come on, now. There's Umaga. Umaga looks dope. I'm not going to lie. He looks dope. So does Omos. Yoko and from the land of the rising sun weighing in at 558 pounds Yoko Zuna What makes Yoko Zuna so scary And Yoko looks good too man that's a fantastic Yoko Zuna model surprising agility to earn the win in any situation With that ability Corey has earned Yoko Zuna victories over all time greats like Brett the Hitman Hart, the immortal Hulk Hogan, and The Undertaker. Yeah, back when WWE knew how to build their monsters, I mean, they build no monster better than Yokozuna. Having him defeat your heroes like Brett the Hitman Hart, Hulk Hogan, The Undertaker, I mean, come on now. Come on now. Rikishi. Rikishi for life. Come on. I find that fitting because the team that they're facing is going to be the NWO, and that's one of their many slogans, right? For life. <laughs> Combined weight of 
All right, so so far so good. We're not having any glitching issues. There's no bugs. The game is staying stable, which I do appreciate. So yeah, uh, Bobby Roode sticks out because again, I never really got a chance to make um, his NWO attire. So I got I got to fix that. But then I don't know. I might replace Rude with um, Omos. Always difficult for the referee to keep order in these matches. There's always an added wrinkle here. Oh, snap. Yeah, so I don't know if you guys are, if you can see very well, but on Miz's trunks, you can see the NWO logos on the sides. So yeah, pretty much everybody except for Bobby Roode is matching up as far as the NWO color scheme is concerned. Oh, they busted Cena open. There's a tag. Damn, he's busted wide open. We're about to find out. And yeah, I'm not playing. We're actually watching this in real time. <laughs> See, Umaga's in there with Cena. Who remembers their classic battle, man? Come on now. So yeah, guys, if you want to get the NWO Arena, and if you want to get the NWO version of these characters, uh, you can look me up on the Community Creations. My gamer tag is XX, capital J, lowercase a y, capital V, and an XX85. When you search for the creator, make sure you type that in. Goes Yoko. That could have been a, a dope fight. Yoko versus Cena. I think that could have been dope. Oh, Cena busted Yoko open. Oh, Yoko's barely showing any blood, though. Looks like he got him in his nose. Nope, stay lit. Dang, Miz did a number on Yoko. I'm surprised. I'm just relieved that all of this is working out. You know what I mean? The, the, the brand new patch, the new bonsai pack. My customs. I'm glad it's all working. That's really all I'm looking for right now. I'm just making sure everything is working the way it should. Uh-oh. Oh, isn't that Miz's signature? And he tags in Cena. 
Allowing Yoko to go for the hot tag to Omas. Let's go. Uh-oh. Cena missed. Cena goofed. Uh-oh. Cena's getting his ass kicked, man. Come on now. I don't think Cena got any offense in. Maybe a little. I guess this is what happens when you go to the dark side. Oh, here comes Yoko. What's Yoko thinking? Yo, y'all about to get counted out. Cena, you better get your ass in the ring. Come on, Omas. That would have sucked, man, if the match ended on a count out. Cena go for the hot tag. He tags in Bob Rude. Or Rob Rude, however you want to say it. Oh, Omos got busted open. Why do I have a feeling at this rate, this match is going to end with everybody bleeding? Oh, I like how you can see the NWO inside the barricade. Uh-oh. Zigglesworth is about to get some. Look at Bobby really trying to knock Omos off and he can't. <laughs> oh. Oh. Uh-oh. I think this is it. Damn. Dude, ain't that a bitch? You got rid of Cesaro and you give him... You give Omos one of Cesaro's moves? That's kind of fucked up, man. I'm just saying. You better take it easy, Omos. You're about to get your team DQ'd. Oh! Yoko, you better get your ass out of the ring. Come on, Rikishi, do something. Don't just shove Ruba off. You got to do something. Uh-oh. Oh! Miz got launched, and then Umaga failed to put Bobby Roode away. Yo, this is actually a pretty exciting match. I'm not going to lie. Oh. Uh-oh. Roode is setting up for something. Oh. One, two, nope. Kishi made the save. Is Umaga bleeding too? Oh yeah, he is. I think the only one not bleeding is Rikishi. And then I 
think Cena is the only one bleeding on the other side. I don't think Ziggler got much in-ring action. If any. That's actually smart, keeping the big man off their feet and then working their leg. Oh, come on. Umaga returned the favor, making the save. to the outside. That's got to suck. <clears throat> Yo, how about the two announce tables? The NWO announce tables? Let's go. Try to throw Omos into the ring, but that wasn't happening. Oh, made him eat the canvas and some apron. Omos, like, man, get your punk ass in the ring. Oh, the hot tag to Cena. Uh, Omar still in control. Follow away slam. Nice. Oh. Uh oh. Cena mounting the comeback. Like you just got in there, you're mounting a comeback. Why would you tag out now? Oh, oh, Omos was stunned though. How did he manage to kick out? He was stunned. Uh oh, hey, hey. She missed though. Uh oh. Oh. Come on, that should be it.
Cena's almost done. I'm oh, going for the pin. Nope. Should have made sure that Cena was completely stunned before pinning him. Uh oh. Oh, Cena has the Huracarana in his game. I'll never forget when he first used the Huracarana against CM Punk. That was crazy. That's it. Ziggler finally gets in there only to get squashed by Yoko. Let's go. Oh, nice counter. I thought Yoko was going for the bonsai again. I find it hard to believe that someone the size of Miz can throw Yokozuna out of the ring like that. Again, you can see the NWO inside the barricade. That's funny. Oh, Miz is finally busted open. By getting tossed into the post, too. Oh, Miz is losing a lot of blood. Somebody's getting counted out. Come on. NWO gonna take it? Nope. Miz broke the count. Oh! That time it made a sound. <laughs> Come on, Yoko. You gotta do something. Yoko getting his ass kicked by Miz. Come on now. Oh. Come on, Yoko. You gotta do something. That's it. It's a wrap. Nope. Omos with the save. Yeah, right. Miz cannot pick up Omos like that. Come on. Is, man it's like four and a half stars this is a dope match come on Yoko oh he caught him better take advantage man take advantage man take advantage Cena with the save uh oh Cena about to pay Oh, maybe not. Yoko's hurt. Damn. Ooh, I think I think it's a wrap. 
NWO 22 takes it. Look at that four and a half star rating, man. Instant classic. So yeah, guys. Uh, I say so far so good. This new patch, I think, is working out. Um, I'm glad to see that my arena is working properly. Um, it's good to see that my customs here are working properly, and it's good to see that the new downloadable uh, superstars from the Bonsai Pack are working properly as well. And so yeah, overall, I'm pretty happy so far. You know what I'm saying? Uh, let me know what you guys think of the match down below. Um, and before anyone asks in the comment section, because I know I'm going to get these people, hey, can I get those custom NWO versions of these characters from you? Yes, Community Creations. There, there's my uh, gamer tag right there at the very top. Double X, JV, Double X, 85. Type that in for when you're searching for a creator, and you can get Dolph Ziggler, NWO Dolph Ziggler, NWO Miz, NWO Cena. Um, yeah, all of those guys, they're all available on there. Um, I still need to make an NWO Bobby Roode, but now that I have Omos, I don't know. I'm debating whether or not I want to keep Roode in the NWO or if I want to replace him with Omos and make an NWO version of Omos. Uh, feel free to let me know in the comment section down below what you think I should do, um, and I will take it into a great deal, of a great deal of consideration. NWO Arena is also available in the Community Creations. Um, it's already got. I, last time I checked, it had well over 200 downloads. Appreciate everyone who's downloaded my, my all my stuff in the community creations, man. That that is awesome. And uh, yeah, don't forget to check the uh, description down below for my merch store link. Uh, if you want to get you know the latest shirt, whether it's this only alpha shirt that I'm wearing or the Poppy Chulo shirt that I showed you earlier, um, both those shirts are available in the second storefront. Um, so when you check the Teespring links, it's going to be the second link. That's the second storefront. Uh, make sure you guys check there if you want the latest shirts. And again, discount code. JV2 will take 10% off on all your purchases. And uh, yeah, I think I pretty much nailed everything. So with all that being said, it is your boy, Jason JV. Um, y'all take care. Have a blessed one. Catch y'all next one. Peace.